Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're gonna talk about how to install Windows 11 if you don't have the minimum requirements, which would be TPM 2.0 and Secure Boot. This has been a problem since Windows 11 was announced because a lot of people were unable to use the Windows Insider program and uh, if they wanted to install it from an ISO, they had this issue because they didn't have TPM 2.0 and Secure Boot. First of all, you should watch my video, that, which will be in the description, where I show you how to download an ISO for Windows 11 and after that you can create a bootable drive, a bootable USB drive if you want and install it on a secondary computer if you want this of course. Now if that computer doesn't support TPM 2.0 and secure but we can easily bypass those with the steps that I'm going to show you in this video. When you are in the first steps of the installation press shift plus F10 here and CMD will pop up. In CMD, type in regedit and then press enter. Go in regedit and expand H key local machine, then system, then setup, and here in setup, create a new key. This new key should be named lab config. Double click on lab config to enter in it. And here in lab config, you need to create two DWORD 32 bit values. The first one should be bypass TPM check, make sure you have BTPMC capitals, and the second one should be bypass your boot check. Double click on each one and set their value to one, and now you should be good to go. You can exit out from here, and you can continue your Windows 11 installation without being bothered with errors that say that you don't have TPM or you don't have secure boot enabled. This is how easily you can install Windows 11 on a computer that doesn't support these features. Of course, this is only working now in these Windows 11 beta versions. We're not sure that this bypass will work on the final versions, but for now you can use it and install Windows 11 on whatever system you want. I'm hoping this video is useful. Don't forget that the link to the video where I show you how to download the Windows 11 ISO will be in the description down below and also the location and the keys that you need to create will be written down below in the description so you can get them from there. If this video is useful, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from tech based. Until next time, have a nice day.